The Living Arts Centre recently played host to a one-of-a-kind conference organized by Safe City Mississauga. In partnership with the Peel Regional Police, Safe City Mississauga worked to produce their annual crime prevention conference. The event had hundreds of individuals in attendance, including several notable keynote speakers who spoke about keeping Mississauga safe. Everyone who attended worked on analyzing Mississauga's latest crime problems, and they all searched for practical ways to make Mississauga a safer place to live. Lyndon King, who is a member of the Board of Directors for Safe City, tells us more. Well, Safe City Mississauga is a not-for-profit organization, and what we do is we build awareness for crime prevention for the city of Mississauga. We, have, we do this by uh, a number of various uh, programs that are within the community. We have a conference every year. Uh, we have conferences based on different categories uh, with regards to crime prevention. Today is harnessing the awareness, so harnessing through the things that work. Uh, we're talking about cyberbullying, social media, um, and we have a no number of keynote speakers that spoke this morning. Safe City Mississauga has held their annual crime prevention conference since 2010. Each year they work to address crime problems through innovative methods. This year they implemented new and interactive breakout discussions which allowed all visitors to learn about different types of crime patterns in the city and openly discuss possible solutions to these problems. After listening to keynote speakers and taking part in breakout discussions, Lyndon King hopes that all attendees will use what they learned at this year's conference to make others aware of present dangers and tackle crime problems in the city. It's very important because, again, it's all about awareness and education, right? And in order for us to promote and educate ourselves, you have to get people in these kinds of sessions. So they come out, they get involved, they become aware. Um, there's certain things that you know you think you may know everything and then all of a sudden you come and you hear someone speak and go oh wow you know what i didn't know that and then you take that away and you educate someone else so word of mouth uh, again using your social media as well and then you educate a lot of people so that's a way we build awareness within our community though the crime prevention conference annually works to remove various forms of danger from mississauga's communities one of the conference's main focuses this year was to make individuals aware of cyber threats such as cyberbullying, identity theft and general threatening behavior that may be present online officer heather cannon of the peel regional police was one of the keynote speakers who addressed this topic she spoke about keeping individuals who use social media safe I spoke on social media and it was really relating to a lot of the positive stuff and um, one thing I, I really like to talk about is the fact that there's a lot of positive stuff happening on social media. I think a lot of people are scared with uh, social media, new things that are coming out. They don't understand, especially adults, or really sometimes a little less likely to try something out. But as far as it goes, we're seeing a lot more positive people trying to start these really positive movements on social media and I think that's really important to put out there but also kind of tempering that with the fact that we have a lot of negative stuff happening and we have to be aware that even though social media is social so we can connect on it because we need to connect as human species we have to as well realize that there are some not so nice people out there so opportunistic criminals and people that may want to hurt you and so we're just trying to give strategies to reduce that risk for more information on other topics that were discussed at the crime prevention conference or to learn more about safe city mississauga's other programs you can visit safecitymississauga.on.ca at the living arts center i'm ryan rocca for rogers tv the free for all organization